a number of people on our campus who either in their personal lives um, or at work um, ha are transgender. I'm Dr. Monica Baskin. I'm a professor in the Division of Preventive Medicine. I'm also the Vice Chair for Culture and Diversity in the Department of Medicine and Associate Director for Community Outreach and Engagement for the UAB Comprehensive Cancer Center. So I think the initiative that really led to the nomination uh, for this award was primarily focused on work that I've done around developing guidelines and procedures um, to help em our employees who might be choosing to undergo gender transition in the workplace. There weren't any specific guidelines or um, steps in terms of ensuring that the employee was supported, but also recognizing how this um, transition might impact other aspects of our enterprise. Every employee deserves our respect, um, they deserve our support, um, and they deserve individuals that can be there for them through this process. But at the same time, when you have um, employees who are cutting across all of our core missions, education, as well as service and clinical work um, and research, it's important that each arm of our mission is also supportive of that transition. So I think in this particular case, um, this individual is an employee who works in patient care, and so it was really vital for us to be very thoughtful of supporting the, the employee, but also being very thoughtful of the patients that um, may be coming across um, in this particular unit. This kind of workplace transition and formally going through that had not occurred prior to this, this particular employee. So I'm very um, proud that the employee at the end of the day after this transition was completed and several months later um, has said that the process was very smooth, um, the person felt very valued and respected and felt like um, they had an advocate during this process. What we started in our department is sort of the departmental guidelines and, and tools and resources has already been expanded across the entire UAB medicine enterprise. Um, so that is being rolled out and I expect to continue to be a resource available at the department and at the larger level um, as in more and more individuals um, decide to have uh, go through a gender transition at work.